Hey guys, welcome to the reasons The Witcher 3 is the better game than Cyberpunk 2077. So starting off first, I have to say, in my own point of view, both games are seriously amazing. I love to play both games. Um, so, I mean, I would definitely pick Witcher 3 all the time in f before Cyberpunk 2077. But Cyberpunk 2077 is also still an amazing game. Um, but they're both really different, so it's actually quite hard to find an opinion what is actually fair, which game is better. I mean, there's some parts we can go on what we will do in this video. So starting off first with the character model. So the character model of Cyberpunk um, there have like as main characters in my opinion like Panem, Judy, Johnny and maybe Takemura. They're all good side characters. Um, I mean the main character is probably V. Um, compared to The Witcher you have Yennefer, Triss, Ciri um, as the main characters. Plus the DLCs you have Siana and Hannah and Rietta. And as a main protagonist Geralt. Um, so I have to say like all characters are written amazing. So uh, I couldn't say that from the side characters that one particular particular there's from the side characters all characters are amazing um, and they're really like it's getting really deep emotional with all characters for comparison Jennifer and Trist the love story compared to Judy and Penham like it's just talking in really high class. Um, but for example, in Witcher, I really like the character, the Red Baron from The Witcher 3. He was amazingly written. Um, and also the characters in the DLCs, they're truly just breathtaking. Um, but yeah, Cyberpunk don't have a DLC yet, so you can't compare that so far. Going further, V compared to Geralt, they're there's a huge difference. I mean, Carrot Geralt is a strong character, which is just already made, you know? Like, there's a backstory, you can feel better connected together because you can see it on a third person. And V is like your own character, and he's taking your own choices. But compared to both, Geralt is truly a stronger character. So there's definitely a plus going for Geralt and the main protagonist from the game. Um, yeah, going further to the gameplay, um, there's a few differences between Cyberpunk and Witcher. So I mean, there's completely different games from the gameplay. So Cyberpunk is a shooter or a RPG with shooter elements, and Witcher 3 is an RPG with more like sword combat. Um, in my opinion, like. I like both, it just depends what you make out of it. But in this case, I truly, in the opinion of The Witcher 3 um, Sword Combat, it's just. I, I don't know, it just feels like nicer, more flowing or fluently um, compared to Cyberpunk. I mean, the combat for an RPG, um, the shooter mechanics are still pretty good. For example, compared to Fallout. But it's still not that like the Witcher's RPG element in the combat. So what I have to say what um, Cyberpunk is making better than the Witcher is that if you're taking off a weapon or finding a weapon later in the game, it is most time better skill. And in the Witcher sometimes you find like a sword and it's just better than your Witcher gear. You're just like, why? So there's no reason for it, and why there's not particular weapons which is way strong. I mean, they change it in the end game, or for example in the DLCs, but before that, it wasn't that good. Um, for the variety, both games have a lot of varieties in doing like the skill level. Um, in which I think most of the people are just using Quen for like <laughs> combat. Um, in Cyberpunk, I think you have more variety for like they're having different play styles. And I think in The Witcher, if you weren't a really badass character, you're going with alchemy and critic 
hit damage or just generally sword gameplay. Yeah, so what I also have to say, compared to the Cyberpunk, I find Witch in this case better. They had just better boss fights. I think I don't didn't came up to a lot of boss fights in Cyberpunk. I'm not sure why, but that's things what Cyberpunk maybe can be, do better in the DLCs or in the f in the developing the game in further. Yes. Um, going next to the world, so we can say about the worlds, both worlds are truly amazing, um, immersive, emotional, catching, atmospheric, it's, it's just crazy, um, but compared to Cyberpunk have this Cyberpunk city, dark and with a lot of economic influence and political issues. Same with Cyber, um, same with The Witcher, with the political issues, but Witcher is more like a fantasy medieval game with a lot of landscape and nature, so it's completely different. So, in my opinion, both worlds are truly amazing. It's just type. What do you like the more? Um, the Cyberpunk world is more compressed. The Witcher world is more large. So, it just depends on your favor. I mean, in my opinion, um, CD Projekt Red just done in both ways as an amazing work. So coming to the soundtrack, so both games are again, guys, they're again different. Um, but I still, I'm still in for The Witcher 3 because I would say, I mean, as you can sound here in the back, you know, like soundtrack of Cyberpunk is a bit more like electro hype and pace level, you know, but it's fitting to the environment and fitting to the world itself. And I still felt like getting goosebumps when Johnny was standing in front of me and had like an amazing conversation with this amazing soundtrack. So I got goosebumps in both games. So what, what I just say is it's just like the sound is amazing. Um, and for example, The Witcher is more instrumental, calm, and emotional soundtrack. I felt a bit more connected to The Witcher because the emotions, I don't know, it just catches me into the game and it's just fitting amazing to the environment. And it was more my type with the fantasy and this emotional, calm, and instrumental soundtrack. But also, Cyberpunk sound was pretty good. Um, yeah, so. But not a plus point for The Witcher in my opinion. But yeah, going further to story. Um, I was to say, just both stories are good, but The Witcher story is just, it's, I don't know, like, it's amazing in my opinion and it's really catch me. I was just got such a tunnel vision while playing The Witcher. I just really felt this game, the characters, the emotion, the story. It got really deep and... It was even also even longer than Cyberpunk. Um, the, I felt like the problem in Cyberpunk, like don't get me wrong, the story is still amazing, but I had some gaps in the story. So like there's a lot of points I didn't understand so far. I think in the future when Cyberpunk is making like, um, continuing with the story and DLCs and stuff like that, I think they will make a way better job. Um, and just change a lot of things in that. So to conclude it in the story, I had a little bit less immersion in the Cyberpunk compared to The Witcher, but I still like the story. But compared to The Witcher, I just, I don't know, I felt more connected to the story of The Witcher. So coming to a conclusion, um, as we mentioned, both games in the beginning are truly amazing. Um, and I think there's, I mean, Witcher is out for like five years, and I think around like two, three years later, till then the game was completely finished. There also were like problems in the beginning, so it's same with Cyberpunk. So I th I feel Cyberpunk will be in the future will be a way better game, and also about the crafting system, they will change in what they done in The Witcher 3 as well. So if you just stay tuned, I think Cyberpunk will be a better game. I think it will not reach the quality, but I mean, maybe the quality, but not the feeling of The Witcher because it's just different. But overall, thanks very much for listening and have a great day, evening and so on.